Welcome to Page Plus. In this video, we're going to take a quick look at the Guide tool. So, for example, on a new blank publication, we'll go up to Ruler Guides here, and in the Ruler Guides dialog, we'll add one horizontal and one vertical guide. Now, if we go ahead and select the Guide tool here, we'll see the two guides that we've just created as red lines. And we can hover over them and click drag to move them. With a guide selected, we can use the Transform tab here to position them exactly. So, for example, I could position this one at 5.5 centimeters on the Y axis and this one at 5.5 centimeters along the X axis. So then, from the Guide tool, we can also very easily create new guides. So to do this, we hold down Control and hover over an existing guide. Then we click, drag, and release the mouse button, and we've created another guide. We can repeat the process, and then select the horizontal guide here, and add some more horizontal guides, like so. We can, of course, shift, select multiple guides, and that will allow us to move all of our selected guides at the same time. Now, we can also space these guides out evenly. So, as I've got multiple guides selected here, I can go into the Align tab here, and we'll see an option for Space Evenly Down. There we go, so that's spaced the horizontal guides. I can then shift, select the vertical guides, and we'll see an option here for space evenly across. Once again, I can space them evenly. And then, of course, with them selected, I can reposition them as well. Finally then, let's select all of the guides and copy them across to a new document. So we'll go to Edit, Copy, and we'll move across to a new publication here. We can simply go into Edit, Paste, and our guides have been pasted across. We can activate the Guide tool with this document, and we'll see the guides. So there's a rundown of the features that the Guide tool offers. If you have any questions or queries, please do ask on the official Serif Community Plus website. Thank you for watching.